This short video demonstrates remote fault identification and reporting features of AMP Trail. Let us consider a three-phase system as shown in the video. FLA3 fault indicators are installed one per each phase. CB refers to the circuit breaker located in substation. Circuit breaker is normally closed under no fault condition. Direction of feeding is as shown in the video. RF GSM RTU is installed on the pole quite close to the FLA3 indicators. Please observe the computer screen in the SCADA workstation which shows presence of three indicators, all the three in line monitoring state indicated by green color. Now let us simulate a fault condition rather a short circuit condition between phases 2 and 3. As soon as the short circuit occurs, the fault current travels from the source up to the point of short circuit and travels back to the source. FLA3 indicators coming in the path of the fault current trip thereby indicating a fault. The indicators give a local indication by means of ultra bright LEDs and red disc. Simultaneously, the circuit breaker will also trip. The fault current disappears as soon as the circuit breaker trips. However, the fault exists and the indicators continue to indicate. FLA3 indicators will then transmit the fault information to the RF GSM RTU over RF. On receiving this information, the RTU processes and communicates the fault information to the SCADA workstation over GPRS. Please observe the computer screen in the SCADA workstation which now shows indicators 2 and 3 in red color indicating a fault. The SCADA workstation will then send a text message with the fault information to predefined GSM numbers. 